Hey, Christian, Ken Kratzer, SCL Radio. Congratulations. That was a remarkable game. I guess just can you tell us about the play in overtime, uh, the third and five, uh, he ran six yards, and uh, just take us through what happened. You, you lost control of the ball, but Jordan Law picked it up. Yeah, um, you know, it was just a, one of our base plays, and the pitch key I was supposed to pitch off of got upfield, so I just kind of cut underneath, and nobody was there, so I was just trying to, you know, again, the end zone, but I got I got stripped. They made a good play on, on the ball, and, uh, you know, I got lucky. Booby was there to pick it up for me. He made a great play. And just just tell us about the competitiveness of this game. Uh, you look like you had control. Air Force made plays in the fourth quarter, but uh, you found a way to win. Just just tell us about what it means to win a game like this. Yes, yeah, it just it's, it kind of builds on our culture. You know, um, we knew this was going to be a tight game. Uh, Air Force they have a really good, a really good team, um, offensively and defensively. They, they did a really good job, um, you know, stopping some of our stuff. But you know, at the end of the day, I think uh, you know we we stop, we never stop um, battling at the end. Um, you know, nobody flinched in overtime. Uh, we just executed when we need to, and it feels really good just to you know get off this uh, three-game losing streak and kind of get that win against Air Force. Thank you. That's all I'm Christian, uh, Ken McMillan from the Times Herald Record, uh, congratulations. Um, what's it like to uh, to knock off Air Force two years in a row in such exciting fashion? Yeah, it's, uh, it's definitely nerve-wracking, you know, coming down, uh, you know, having it come down to like a last drive type of deal. Um, you know, but our guys, we never stop fighting. Um, you know, that's something we preach in our locker room all the time is don't quit, don't flinch. And I think our guys have always responded when, when we need to. Um, we always make plays when we need to, and I think that showed up today. And take us through the uh, the 79-yard touchdown throw to uh, T. Rob. Yeah, I mean that was a play we practiced. Uh, that was a play we uh, practiced a lot during the week. Um, you know, they they covered it up pretty well. That was my last my last read on the progression, um, and I just saw him kind of late, and I tried to give him a good pass, and he you know he made a good catch and was able to take it all the way. And just on the uh, the, the winning touchdown. Uh, I know it's a negative, but how sickening a feeling was it when you knew that you lost the ball and then the revert, the elation of seeing Booby uh, fall on it? Yeah, I mean, my heart dropped. You know, obviously I, I felt the ball pop out. Um, and, you know, I, I got kind of lucky that Booby was there to, to recover. I didn't know who, who came up with it at first, but, you know, God was on our side right there and he was able to recover the football.